North Korea is dialing up the rhetoric again after a weeks-long period of relative calm. A North Korean overseas propaganda group is warning that the regime will unleash an unimaginable strike at an unpredictable time. It appears Pyongyang is using unofficial channels to take issue with the joint Seoul-Washington naval exercise that draws to an end today. I'll Park Jong-hong with the details. Breaking a month-long silence, North Korea is back with its war rhetoric. A North Korean propaganda outlet has blasted the ongoing South Korea-U.S. naval military drill and claimed the country could launch a blitzkrieg attack. Amid the continued reckless military action, there should be no mistake, not even for a minute, that our self-defense action will be carried out at any time. What's raising eyebrows is that the announcement quoted remarks by an overseas propaganda channel and not the foreign ministry or any official agency. What's more, the fact remains that North Korea has refrained from ramping up tension for over a month after it announced it would unleash its strongest provocation. The most recent provocation was in mid-September when North Korea launched a ballistic missile thought to be capable of striking mid- to long-range targets. There have been fears the North could take action on October 10th, the founding anniversary of North Korea's Workers' Party, or October 18th that marked the start of China's Communist Party Congress. Another propaganda channel slammed the joint naval drill as, quote, the onset of war without a declaration. It warned the U.S. not to resort to reckless behavior or it would face unimaginable consequences. Beyond the rhetoric, some predict the North may be seeking dialogue with the U.S. via a director-level official visiting Russia. Others say the situation must be closely observed with caution. In any case, most agree the month-long void of any provocation is highly unusual, especially with the South Korea-U.S. drill drawing to a close. Park Jong-hong, Arirang News.